Ever wondered how fast a human can possibly run, or how mathematics can help us understand speed? Welcome to our deep dive into the fascinating world of speed and math. We begin with an impressive feat, a recorded maximum speed of 12.5 meters per second. This remarkable speed wasn't just plucked out of thin air, it's based on GPS coordinates and timestamps, recorded with precision. Imagine this, two coordinates captured just a second apart. These serve as the starting blocks for our calculations. Now, to measure the distance between these two points, we employ the Vincenti formula, a handy tool for short distances. After crunching the numbers, we get a distance of 11.13 meters. Now, here's where the magic of math comes in. We divide this distance by the time taken, which is one second, giving us an average speed of 11.13 meters per second. But hold on a second. You might be thinking, that's not 12.5 meters per second. You're right, it's not. But consider this. The recorded speed could be an instantaneous peak, a fleeting moment of higher speed. And let's not forget, GPS data, while incredibly useful, isn't perfect. Tiny errors can and do creep in. So the difference between the calculated and recorded speed can be chalked up to these factors. What this means is that our calculated speed of 11.13 meters per second supports the validity of the recorded maximum speed of 12.5 meters per second. With the power of mathematics, we can validate the incredible speed of 12.5 meters per second. So keep chasing your speed goals, and remember that a little bit of math can go a long way. That's it for our deep dive into the math of speed. Stay tuned for more fascinating insights into the world of numbers. Until next time, Keep those calculators ready and your minds open.